Don from Arctic Fishing here. I'm on a public lake in uh, Pennsylvania. I don't want to get out of that location because um, this lake was just recently restored. The dam was repaired twice. And the bass and muskie fishing has been here fantastic. So I'm going to target muskies today. Uh, I'm going to start out using a 9 inch money minnow. I get untangled here. Anyways, I'm going to start out using a 9 inch money minnow with a 10 out weighted hook. I'm using a St. Croix Premier. 7 foot heavy power 2 piece and a Daiwa Alexa uh, 400 left handed version. So that's what I'm going to start out with and then uh, go from there. I'm going to go for the fish of a 10,000 cast. So stay tuned. Click that like button. Leave a comment below. Make sure you subscribe to this channel if you're new to this channel. And always remember navigate life and go fishing. I was not that happy. Put him out of his home. Ow! <laughs> Stop! That 16 and a half inch bass caught him. Caught him in a Berkeley Habit four inch crayfish, five out weighted hook. I'm a Gatsu five. Yeah, it's a I'm a Gatsu five out weighted hook, four inch Berkeley Havoc. Um, I don't remember the color, but it's brown and orange. Just caught him on a public lake. 16 inch largemouth bass. Catch and release. There you go, fish number two. Should have been number three, I lost one. Seventeen inch largemouth bass, second one of the day. Caught him on the Berkeley Habit. Catch and release. Oh yeah, baby. Look at that. That's a beauty. We're going to measure and weigh that one. Let's start with the measurement. That's about ooh, 18 inches. Wow. Look how fat she is, man. That's an 18 inch. I'm going to weigh her. She measures 18 inches. I think I left my digital scale at home, but I can use the analog. Oh, it's full of water. Saying three pounds, but she's full of water, so I don't know how accurate it is. It's probably more than three. I don't know, it's tough to say. But it's 18 inches. Throw a live I'll take some pictures. Alright, found my electronic scale. It's way back in the uh, back of the glove box. Hopefully this one works. Okay, there we go. One zero out. Okay, there we go. Zeroed out. This is that 18 inch bass. I had it in live well because I was looking for my uh, scale. I was on the boat the whole time. Got a wee fish then. Okay, well, the other one says three pounds. This is saying 1.32. 
Well, not hard to believe that. This thing must not be accurate either. I don't know. It could be, but it kind of surprises me. Catch and release. Just a little guy, but I'll take him. Let's see what he measures. I think he's 11, 12 inches. Oh, that's just too funny. Little guy spazzing. Stop. Throw you back. Yeah, 11 inches. 11 inch largemouth. Catch and release. Hey, John from Arc Fishing here. So, as you can tell, musky fishing didn't turn out really well. So, it's a good thing I had a backup plan. I went for bass. So it's a good day of bass fishing. I caught five fish. I caught a 16, 17, and 18 incher. <laughs> That's pretty ironic, all in a row. An 11 incher. Plus, I lost two. They got off. I had them onto the boat. Got to bring my net, and right at the boat, they spit the hook, pulled off. But here's what I was using it was a Berkeley Havoc um, Skeet Reese Design Pit Balls, four inch. Um, I was using um, also a Gamagata 5 uh, weighted hook with this. So that's what was catching today. I was also using the G Loomis GL2 casting rod, 6 foot 6 inch Shimano Canyon Reel and a 14 pound test suffix clear monofilament. So, anyways, hope you enjoyed this video. If you're new to this channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Um, and always remember navigate life and go fishing. Thanks for watching. Thank you.